In a groundbreaking move, the spot Bitcoin ETF issuer Franklin Templeton reduced its sponsor fee, setting the record for the lowest fee among its competitors. Uh, the filing dated January for 12 suggests that the firm has decided to lower its annual Bitcoin ETF fee from 0.29% to 0.19%. And um, in the filing where the firm proposed a reduction of 10 basis points in the sponsor's fee, um, it introduced a fee waiver for the next six months. It noted that from January 12th uh, through August 2nd this year, zero charges would be applicable on the ETF uh, for the first $10 billion of the fund's assets. The fee cut positions Franklin Templeton as one of the strongest competitors for major players, such as Grayscale, BlackRock, and ARC21 shares. Over earlier, Bitwise was the one that offered the cheapest fee of 20 percent uh, applicable after the initial six-month waiver. Uh, moreover, ARC21 shares and Fidelity also offer a lucrative post-waiver fee from a sort of 0.25 percent. Although Van Eck mirrors ARC21 shares fee model, it doesn't offer any waiver. Whilst Grayscale stands with the highest sponsor fee of 1.5 percent, down from the 2 percent proposed earlier. And BlackRock's iShares charges a $1.20% fee during the first 12 months of their ETF going live or until it attains $5 billion in assets. Whilst their post-waiver fee stands at 0.3%. Furthermore, Wizentree is slated to charge 0.3% as a post-waiver fee. Meanwhile, Invesco and Valkyrie joined the Bitcoin ETF fee race with an annual fee of 0.39% and 0.49% respectively. Uh, Hashtags has set a 0.19% sponsor fee, which could be detrimental for its ETF's performance considering the lowest fee of 0.19%. Moreover, it has refused to offer any fee with waiver. It could be a potential challenge since it's not a significant player like Grayscale, which was able to maintain its position despite high charges. The first day of trading for spot Bitcoin ETFs on Wall Street saw remarkable activity with Grayscale taking a lead. The ETFs recorded over $4 billion in trading volumes during the grand debut. A total of 11 spot Bitcoin ETFs, including offerings from major investment players like BlackRock Inc. and ARK Invest, went live on Thursday, January 11. The Bitcoin ETFs registered a massive trade volume of $4.6 billion. Industry advocates see these ETFs as a crucial stepping stone for broader adoption by everyday investors, anticipating them undercared to act as a catalyst for further market gain. Eric Balchunas, the Boomer ETF analyst, reported a total of 700,000 individual trades executed on the first day across the 11 spot ETS. Balchunas noted that the increased grassroots of action exceeded his expectations and is viewed positively.